pushing back against employers' vaccination policies. More than 70 percent of unvaccinated Americans say they would quit their job if their employer had a vaccine mandate without exemptions. That's according to a recent Washington Post and ABC News poll. A separate survey shows 52 percent of companies could have one or more vaccine requirements by the end of the year. More Americans than ever say it's unlikely they will work late into their 60s. According to new data from the New York Federal Reserve, just 50 percent of people expect to work past the age of 62, with only a third of people expecting to work past the age of 67. The data reinforces other studies showing a wave of early retirement triggered by the coronavirus pandemic. More than a million older Americans have left the workforce since March 2020. The number of job openings in the U.S. hit a record high for a fifth straight month in July. The total number of job openings rose by 749,000 to a record 10.9 million in July. Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade is welcoming back spectators. The famous parade will return to the streets of New York City and will once again be open to the public. The 95th annual event will showcase its iconic full-size balloons, live performances, and marching bands that were originally expected to perform in last year's parade. The holiday spectacle was scaled down to a televised broadcast only last year due to the COVID-19 pandemic. Working hard or hardly working? A wallet hub survey has named Alaska the hardest working state in the nation, followed by North Dakota and Nebraska. The least hardworking state is New Mexico. Kentucky's in the middle in 24th place. The survey took into account the average work week, unemployment rate, idle youth, and average leisure time. There you go, five things to know before you go to bed.